Hi guys, I'm Sky Gerald. The video I made today is to guide new players to farm in Isle of Dawn. So I'm gonna show you guys the locations of the collectible candles, waxes in this realm. What I'm gonna show you has no shortcuts, so if you're looking for that, you can just skip ahead. What I'm showing you now is the basic route. You can just fly over the cave. From here, we have to go to our left. Our next candle location is a bit far, so if you don't have wing power or running out of light, you can just use the butterfly from the bottom. Before you could enter the door, it will require you three spirits from hidden forest. And after getting the candles, we had to go back and fly to the right side of Isle of Dawn. So this is our next candle location. This also has a wing light and you can only unlock this if you have one spirit from this map. Our next candle location is just at the side of the temple. We just have to fly to get there. If you're running out of light, you can just go to the butterflies. And once we get to the platform, we have to go to the right side of the temple. Although the door will require two spirits from the map. And once we get all of them, we know how to proceed to the right side of the temple. Because from here, you will be seeing a cloud tunnel. And this tunnel will lead us to our new candle location. This is a two-player door by the way. Uh, I'm just thankful that I have someone with me when I was filming this video. Oh guys, you have to light the torch over there. This is to activate the elevator for the candles inside. But since for me the door is already opened, I can just fly up. Once we get the candles, we have to go back at the front of the door. We just have to fly slowly upwards. And proceed going inside of the cave. You might not be able to see the cave at the right if you'll continue jumping. So I suggest to just take it slowly. There you go. Now let's just continue to go up because there's a candle cake up there. Well, the next area that we are about to go is to the Cave of Prophecy. For those of you who don't know, entrance to the Cave of Prophecy is just under these clouds. The door can be unlocked once you already have two spirits from Hidden Forest. First thing that we have to get here is the candle cake and the one above this area. First trial that we have to do is water. I'm not gonna be showing you guys the stuff that's going on around here. Once we reach the end of the trial, we have to go back to get the candle cakes that you probably saw while doing the obstacles. You just have to take note to the save point. Next, we'll be at the left of this trial.
and then behind the mountain. Now we proceed to Child Savard. And also I'm not going to be showing you all the obstacles in every child. Because all of the candle bundles are at the end. Same goes with Childs of Air and Fire. There you have it guys, make sure to follow my social platforms and then hit like and subscribe. Bye bye everyone, see you next time.